Brandar gets a bit of the drink in him and off he goes. <laughs> we have much work to do. Little time to do it. Ah. Brandar le le leans toward finding a way out of this land. Oh, watch your feet on those, those rocks, Richard. Very dangerous. Ah, but where should Brandar go? Back to Cyrodiil. Hmm. We have much unfinished work there. I think uh, some of the Emperor's Blades should be looking for Brandar. But maybe my... My lack of duty can be forgiven. I'm quite unsure. Yes. Is it worth the risk, is my question. What would I be going back to Cyrodiil for? Looks like we got ourselves a hero. Oh. Not a hero, friends. Just passing through. Hmm. A farm. Stay here, Richard. Daddy will make sure the bandits don't come to this farm. Ah. Over the wall. Here we are. <laughs> Hello to you. I submit. There is no submission. It is over for you. As soon as it started, you should know. This was not going to go well. It would have let you go as well. But you put these people in danger, you see? Look at this corpse in the road. And now another. <laughs> Join your friend. Hmm. Both bandits they were. Vying for a, a piece of the pie, I'd wager. Well, now Brandar will eat all the pie. <laughs> what have you in this chest? Ah. Now this is some armor. Increasing health. I can get behind that. Let us try it on. See how it fits. Hmm. Right now we've got vampire's armor, which uh, not so good. If one were to ask me. I would like to try this elven armor. Ah, looking quite snazzy, yes. Nicely done. I shall uh, hang on to this for at least a little while. See uh, which one serves me better. Without my vampire robes, my destruction spells do cost a bit more, but it should be well enough. And another bandit. Came too close to the village, I think you did. <laughs> These farmers not to be trifled with. Oh my, and where has Richard gone off to? Silly boy. Always running away. The first hint of danger. Well, I suppose it's you and me, Migo. Let us look for Brother Richard while we are at it. Hmm, I don't hold such hopes. Behind the beehive, perhaps? No, no, no indeed. Ah, well. We shall be reunited at some point. Ah, some point sooner than I thought. What are you doing behind this house, huh? You find some lovely grass to munch? A tender fern? That is not for you, Richard. These farmers work quite hard. You must be uh, a bit more respectful of the things they have grown, huh? Oh. A little village sprang up. Hold one moment. There you are, boy. Please stay here. Make sure Richard does not wander, hmm? Hello there! Sorry, I don't mean to be rude, but Juan's the one who deals with people. I'm afraid I lost my charm years ago. 
Well, could I ask you uh, quite quickly, your name is Rorik, is this the town of Rorikstead? Yes, that's right. Look around you. Most of the lands you see are mine. Most of this I purchased while my comrades were fighting in the south, helping the Empire against the Aldmeri Dominion. Back then, nothing would grow here, and so the land was worthless. Now, thanks to the hard work and the God's blessings, our farms prosper. Fascinating. So it seems war has been quite profitable for you, huh? Alright then. Alright then. I'm looking for uh, that Mr. Sam. He owes me a staff, he does. No offense intended. Perhaps he is in the, uh, the inn, lurking. As uh, these sorts of people are wont to I do. I was a different man once. Luring Strong. someone into man. another drinking contest. <sighs> Young. But the Great War was a long time ago. Ah, why you keep talking to me? I thought we were done with this conversation. Brandar's on a mission, can you not see? Hmm? I suppose he can't. Blinded by greed. <laughs> Hello there. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Oh, you've got wares for sale, huh? Yeah, yes, let's have a look. Take a look. Let us have a look. Why not? I know you've got some good things here, huh? Brandar has some good things as well. Won't you buy this battle axe? Very nice. I rather like this uh, dwarven bow. I think I shall keep, but this dagger, yes. Found very recently, just on the road. Brendar has keen eyes, you see. Khajiit are able to spot things that others might miss. Ah, and a bit of elven armor. Are you in the market? Hmm, yes. I suspected you would be. Yes, uh, I must keep these robes for now. Hmm, I believe that is all that I have for you. Perhaps you have something for me, hmm? Some lockpicks? Oh, 24 of them, yes indeed. Thank you so much. Farewell. And to you. A bit more stocked, I think. But no Mr. Sam lurking about. Unfortunate that. Who might we ask about this fellow, huh? Oh. You! You've got a lot of nerve showing yourself in this town again. What do you have to say for yourself? I have no idea what you're talking about, friend. Is that so? Does the name Gleda ring a bell? The star beauty of my farm? Kidnapped by a drunk lout and sold to a giant? You better remember her right fast before I call the guards and have you hauled away. Oh, that, that's a pretty hefty accusation there, friend. You're damn right it does. I'll never breed another prize-winning goat like Gleda. And don't you think of coming back to Rorikstead until you get her back from that giant. Oh... Gleda the goat has been sacrificed to a giant. Oh my. Did I say anything about the staff when I was here last? Or have you heard of someone named Mr. Sam, at the very least? You mentioned something like that when you were running off with my goat. Tell you what, you bring back my goat, and maybe I'll give a damn about your staff. Fair enough. Could you tell me exactly what happened? Maybe the location that you last saw her? Or the location that I was last running in with her? If that is indeed the case? You really don't remember stealing a goat and selling her to a giant? No. Are you sick? Go get her! At least she's bound to follow you back. You smell just like the fermented feed she likes. Well enough. I shall have a look, friend. Uh... I apologize for that. I must fix my misdeeds. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ah, bit of a mistake there. You said you'd let me know well, that is at least uh, somewhat of a lead. Was not able to find Mr. Sam, but uh, we might have to go have an encounter with a giant, which. I'm looking forward to quite a bit less. 
I thought this would be so easy. Hey, we're in Rorikstead. Now I get my staff, right? <laughs> Never happened. Never so easy. Well, giants do seem to uh, stick to the hills. Perhaps we should head up this way. Just to make sure. That poor little goat probably eaten by now. If I know anything about giants. Which, uh, quite honestly, I don't. Would I be able to talk to one? If I were drunk enough? Huh. <laughs> Seems a bit ridiculous, I think. Ah, and there. Some giants, indeed. Alright. Richard, Miko. Stay here, my friends. Oh, taking your time, aren't you? Easy life for a dog. Please wait. Alright. Let's at least try to uh, sneak up and find this goat. I don't think he's going to be bargained with. Hmm. Let's just try to go get the goat. Hello, little goat. Ah, 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 ah. I think these giants do have poor eyesight. Hmm. I dare not pick a fight with him. Oh, looking right at me he is. Please not this way. Let's go around. Oh, he does like this goat quite a bit. Have you uh, grown fond of this goat? In an unhealthy sense? Hey, goat. Goat, come with me. Oh my. Not good, not good. My goodness. Back to the town. Perhaps the guards could help me. In this uh, tiny matter. <laughs> Not so tiny it is. Oh, Ni Miko, no! Please, please. Stay away from the giant, huh? Is the, is the goat coming? All of these animals. They have such love for Brandog. And who could blame them, huh? Pull out the loot, strum a little song. The goat comes along. Hmm. Where is this giant gone now? Hmm, the deers don't seem scared of him. Yes. Come along, goat. The giant seems to have given up. But I do hope Miko is okay. Ah. Dog's mouth is a bit bigger than his brain. Oh, I see a big, big thing. I want to latch onto the heels. No, please do not. Hmm. Oh, I don't know. Yes, we'd make more money, but I don't like the idea of you traveling alone out there with the war and dragons. Come on now, we discussed that. I wouldn't be traveling all of Skyrim. It'd just be to Whiterun and back. That's it. Tomorrow. I'll let you know tomorrow. Tomorrow and the next day. Hmm. Are you Did so you scared? See those guards? Get out of line and you'll have them to deal with. Ah, Brenda does not fear the guards. Interesting that the high elf would marry uh what a, a Dunmer, are you? Yeah, regardless. I brought your Name's goat back. Ennis. If you've got friends who do business in Whiterun, they might know me. I, I know your name quite well. We've had a conversation before. I brought you back your goat, if you would Glad like. Her. I'm not a scratch on her. Happy day! I still can't figure out why you stole her. You left a note explaining it, but half of it was gibberish and the rest had mead spilled on it. Only <laughs> bit I could make out was repaying Isolde in Whiterun. And even that's mostly scribbles. 
Guess you could try there. See you. Hmm. Thank you so much for the lead. Isolda in the white run. Hello, God. I'm sorry for what happened. Ah, like I've said, Brandar gets a bit of the drink in him and off he goes. On to adventure. Well, in that way I suppose it's not so similar from not having any meat. <laughs> oh my. The, the trouble I get into, huh? Seems that giant uh, forgave me. They're quite lazy, I think. Don't want to run so far. No, indeed. Now the question becomes, where did I leave that Richard? Richard and me go hanging on the mountain. Hmm, it was just somewhere over here. Yes. Hello, my boy. Where's the other one? Where's he gone, huh? Oh, look in your eyes. Has something bad happened to Miko? Miko! Miko! Are you out here? Ah, uh, perhaps he's been taken in exchange for the goat. Hmm, certainly not the fate that I would have wished for him. Unfortunate. Perhaps he will escape. We might meet again. Hello, giant. Remember me? Have you seen my dog? Not in the talking mood, I think. How could this man say that uh, I had a conversation with a giant? Surely they do have a, a culture of their own. They paint words and such, but Brandar cannot speak giant. Unless uh, there's something else to learn about myself. People saying, oh, this and that about the dragons. You're, you're a brother of the dragons. I assure you I am not. But maybe they think the same about the giants. Maybe we are all one. We are the world. Ah. Wolf lurking in the distance. You care for some of this, do you? How's that? Ah. He leaped forward with the snapping jaws. But he was cut short. Now what is this? Ridiculousness, huh? Oh, somebody seems to have left some goodies. Swords and shields. No. It doesn't seem much of interest this year. Aside from a few precious alchemical ingredients. Fascinating. We should find some other adventures to get to, Richard. Ah, uh, make sure to tramp heavily, so that Miko might find us as we head this way. I think that the uh, White Run lies down this way, and I can at least try to retrace my steps, get the staff that I was promised so long ago. So many promises in this land, and so many broken promises as well. Quite an interesting smell in this cave. The bones strewn about makes me think that it is not inhabited by human. Ah, but there's uh, one surefire way to find out, huh? Butterfly! You flutter by? Not fast enough! <laughs> Oh, let us have a look in here. Give uh, Miko some time to catch up to us, shall we? 
I know in my heart that he is just fine. He must be. Oh. I was right in assuming that uh, what was in this cave was indeed not human. But it sure does look human, doesn't it? Fascinating. But he must be purged. Oh my goodness. Let me take some of these junipers. Old steady Brandar. Don't be scared out of hiding. Simple vampires. No problem at all. Oh. I thought surely they had found me. But this bush. This is a good hiding bush. I like this bush. More for this vampire, huh? There you are. Down you go. Ah, but the skeletons have found me. I think this would be a good chance to test out the Dawnbreaker, huh? Ha! Oh, -ho. the Dawnbreaker might purge this place with relative ease, huh? Hmm, even the vampires cannot stand to its might. Rubies, a little bit of dust. All that remains of you, huh? How about you, Mr. Skeleton? <laughs> Not quick enough. Oh, they get so brave, you know? I'm right up to Brandar. Hey, what's that? What's that you have there? Glowing sword? Yes. Maybe you should steer clear of the glowing sword. Just a suggestion. This is what Brandar would do. There we are. What does this chest hold? Ugh. I'm not a fan of this shield, but uh, someone will be. I will take. <laughs> hmm. Yes, it's an interesting melange of uh, death and magic. Not right. All at the same time. Something is not right. And I'll tell you what's not right down here, friends. It's gone now. You. He's what's gone. that? <laughs> <Here you are. laughs> Mr. Vampire. <laughs> Let's chop him up. <laughs> And some of this. Ah. Ah. My goodness, sucking the life right out of me. Ah. Well, we must uh, get some poisons, I suppose. Yes, this will do nicely. And then a bit of healing, just so I don't heal over. Ah. Ah. Quite nice, this Dawnbreaker. I thank Meridia for bestowing me with such a such a gift, you know? Who would have thought? This vampire seemed to be the head vampire. And so easily he was taken apart by the Dawnbreaker. Ah, what sort of goods have you down here, huh? This black soul gem. I wonder what the purpose is. And I seem to have blown uh, all of his implements off of the shelf. No matter. I don't think uh, many other people will be visiting down here anymore. Hmm. Nice large chest. Yes, I take. Very nice. Fast healing spell. I should be learning a bit more of these magics, yes? Ring of Conjuration. 
Hmm, Brandar does not play with conjuration. Summoning things from oblivion? Hmm. Never a good idea. I've seen what lies there, friends. Oblivion is not a plane that you want to toy with. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friend.